I'm going to show you how to draw characters because I know it's really difficult when you're starting out to, to get a character and make them look exactly the same from one drawing to another. So this is going to be a little exercise in showing you how to turn a character around and see them from different angles. Okay, so let's go. Okay, well, this is my very first book that I ever did and this is Lydia and learning to draw her from different angles. It's really, really hard, I remember. And this is kind of, you know, 25 years ago now or something. Uh, <laughs> these books are still out in America. Um, and what I did was I created what I call Lydia's Bible. And these are all, this is not what she looked like in the end. But somewhere towards the back, you will find that what I did was here. You can see these kind of lines starting to appear. And really starting to analyse the uh, character. And these lines here allow me to twist the character around and draw her from different angles. And I'll show you very basically how that works. Okay, so if we start off with a... I'm going to do this a really, really simple character, okay? So it's just... A, a circle and if we have a line across the middle that's where his eyes are going to be and I'm going to have really simple eyes just give him very simple eyes like that and then he's going to be equal on both sides of his face so we give him a little nose there and a little mouth and let's say just to make things really easy for us that we kind of have a line there that his ears will be from the top of his eyes to the bottom of his mouth. We want a little, that's his bottom lip. Okay? Now what we want to do is from there, draw outwards. This is very rough, okay? <laughs> Don't blame me if it goes a bit wrong. So that's kind of the, the basic marks that we need there. Like that, okay? Now over here, draw another circle and this circle is going to be on the top line and the bottom line. It's going to be exactly the same kind of size. And let's just prepare another one over here. Let's see what we can do with that. Okay. Now, this is not a circle, is it? It's a ball. Here it's just a two-dimensional flat kind of thing, but really his head is a ball. So what you want to do is have a line coming from the top, just like that, coming down to the bottom like that. But instead of coming straight down, it's kind of you want a kind of a, a, a melon rind, don't you? It's kind of like a melon rind or a half moon or something like that. What would you call it? A moon shape. So this is this line here has moved around as 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 if you had a ball and you'd drawn a line on it and then you just twisted it around. So this eye will be over here and this eye will be over here and there'll be a bigger gap between it because this one's nearer to you. His nose is just here so you can give a little nose like that and his mouth is just there with a the bottom lip underneath it and you can see the character is there you can see it <laughs> so the ear will be kind of like that and you won't be able to see the ear on the other side. Now on this side here uh, take it all the way through and let's have his eye there his nose is going to be down there and his mouth is there a the little bottom lip like that and we can give him some eyebrows just for a little bit of expression now the ear is going to be here isn't it because we'd work that out and you can see in just these simple simple lines that you've kind of got a character in there already so if we work this up a bit um, and let me give this some hair on the top like that and and again if you think where that hair is starting it's kind of halfway across this half so it's going to be about there isn't it and then it's coming down to the middle like that and then it's coming down to the ear 
and then you've got a, a parting over on that side and the hair is much bigger than the head I'm just going to scribble this in because I haven't got long um, and let's bring that oh that's gone a bit fat I think but anyway bring that in like that and again here bring that something like that and this hair is coming it's kind of being flicked over the top kind of like that and then there'll be a bit of a side burn there and then that's going to be something like that I'm just going to scribble that in very quickly and you can see we've basically got the character built up and it's very 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 simple character and this is how you learn to twist it around and I do still do this but you know very very quick I, I do this while I'm working out a character but very very quickly I kind of understand the character and, and in the end I can just do it in my head and I can draw them from whatever angle so you know if you wanted to draw him from below then say the nose line is going to be a melon thing again and the melon thing there so that's where his nose will be and his eyes will be there and his mouth will be there and we know that his ears is going to be like that something like that and so if he's looking up he's going to be something like that and if you want him looking down then again you'll have say that that's his eye line then he'll be kind of looking down like that and and by using this ball and the lines on the shape that's how you can uh, work the whole thing out and after a while it's, it's, it's practice you know I know I keep going on about this but if you keep practicing it, it all starts coming together so uh, so there practice that's all I can say <laughs> you just keep doing it and uh, I just keep keep drawing these kind of things and building up characters and, and building up these little things which are reference reference sheets that you can go back to when you're working on a character because I know how really difficult it is when you're doing a cartoon series or something like that. if you're an illustrator and you're doing a series of drawings of a character trying to make them look the same from one drawing to another is really really difficult and this is one of the secrets